All right, here it is. I uh, was waiting for this one since a while. Actually, I had one of those square RGB lights for camera, but that's the first time that I have one of those wand, RGB light wand, wand style. So hopefully I can also mount that on camera somewhere, but it's mainly to keep it uh, by hand. Uh, I needed an extra light that I can hold by hand while filming. So that should do it. Let's see now what's in the box, what they give me with this set. It's right now. Okay, so opening the box. <laughs> I like what I see. There is this uh, very nice velvet uh, bag slash pouch that they give you with this equipment. So that's good. That means uh, when uh, I'm done uh, with it, I can just put it back in this bag and it's protected in the, inside this nice, uh, it's very, very nice, <laughs> this nice velvet pouch. And in the box, we do have the user manual and the thank you card, so classic. Now, let's see what's inside this mysterious velvety bag. All right, opening it. And oh, it has two compartments. Excellent, interesting. So the bag has two compartments. So I guess the big compartment is for the light itself. And right there, I can see already it has this one quarter screw for tripod mount. So that's perfect. That's what I wanted to see. And here it is. It's quite nice. It has this uh, opaque filter here, so that's good. You don't see the LED right there. I like when they put some uh, diffusing filter like, like so. And on the back, we see some uh, small uh, LCD screen here, some uh, adjustment knob over here, USB-C port in the back here, so that's good. That means this light is USB-C. Perfect, I like when they use modern technology. <laughs> a lot of other tech that I use, I use micro USB. I hope more and more people will use USB-C. And that's it, there is the brand there. Oh, on both sides, look at that. On both sides, you have this one quarter screw mount. So you can choose where, <laughs> whichever side you want to mount on the tripod. And why not putting on the other side some uh, extra accessory? It's possible with those uh, two screws. All right, let's check out what's left in this bag. So the compartment on the side, we do have here. Oula. So this thing that just got ejected on the floor, let's check what it is. Oh, it's some uh, cable tie, Velcro cable tie. They just rolled up together. So it's like cable management. Oops, cable tie, very light. Okay, so two of them, that's good. Now, next thing on the bag that got ejected almost was this. And this is the charging cable, the USB to USB-C cable. So here it is. I have tons of those, so I may, maybe I will not use this one, but in case if uh, you don't have any, they are included. So cable to recharge the lamp right there, USB-C to USB. Let's see what else in the bag. I feel something else there. The last uh, mystery gift, if I can say that. Oh, look at that. A small tripod. They give us already a small tripod. Up. That's good. <laughs> well, that will go along with all my other tripods. I didn't expect it actually an, an extra tripod, so that's good. And actually, there is something else in this bag that I can feel. Let's see what it is. Oh. Tons of something actually. Look at that. They give you tons of things. So here are some metal plates with 3M uh, sticker on one side. So one side is just metal and one side it's 3M. And <laughs> that's also nice if you want to keep the wand uh, around uh, your arm, or I should say if you want to have it secure, you put that around your wrist like so. And then you screw that on the bottom of the wand here like so and then you can have your wand secure so in case if you are holding it with the hands like that and then the light fall up <laughs> you have this protection so that's nice that they included also the wristband in there that's all uh, for the bag yeah nothing else in the bag so i will put everything here so you can see me yeah, i'm already impatient to try everything <laughs> so here it is all uh, that is included uh, with this set. Let's tilt the camera down slowly. 
here we go so here we go guys now you have an idea if you order the same one like i did the same rgb wand lighting one so you know what's included in your package all right now i'm just impatient to try it and see how this thing perform <laughs> all right so charging this lamp it's very easy it's usb-c i use any usb-c cable that i have laying around up plug it there and that's it right away we can see that it's charging it's almost full actually from factory so that's good also i find out here that there is a plastic protecting this uh, screen so don't forget to remove it if you don't see well what's written on it or the display that means it's because you forgot to remove this protection plastic so don't forget to remove it mm -hmm. now it looks nice and shiny yes all right now that the light is fully charged let's try it and see how it performs so to turn it on very easy there is this big knob here you cannot miss it you just press and hold it in a few seconds up and the light turn on so the first mode that the light turned on into it's this uh, RGB mode. So here we go, a little bit focus. So basically, with the knob, you can select each color and then select the color you just want to uh, turn on. Basically, it's leave on with this one. So here, for example, I can change the red intensity, the red color. So with this knob, see the little arrow is selected on the red. So I just have to adjust it with this knob so the more I remove the red the more other color will be dominant and it goes all the way to 255 and if I pass it I will go to zero so here we go to select each color that you want to mix them up and then you have the result that's nice <laughs> but wait there is more <laughs> This light have actually other function. If you double click this uh, button when you are on this uh, mode, hop, we pass to pre-selected mode. So that means there is some pre-selected program on this light. For example, the one uh, displaying now, it's lightning. So it simulates lightning. And there's this uh, pre-selected mode. There is a, a bunch of them. Uh, each mode, you can select the brightness you want. See, brightness is 20%. Scene one, so it's a pre-selected uh, scene, I should say. So if I increase here, it will increase the intensity of each mode. See, forty percent is quite bright now already. All right, and to change mode, I just click once, and now it's change the scene. <laughs> I keep saying mode, but it's actually the scene changing. So it's lighting too, and then another one. Let's see. Now this one, it's cinema. So it simulates light that uh, you have in uh, all the movie style. All right, it's a kind of pulsating light. Next scene, scene three, it's police. No, scene four, sorry. Scene four, it's police. You don't play with that if you are not part of the police force, by the way. Uh, scene five, it's ambulance. Here we go. Scene six, it's fire truck, fire department. Uh, the scene uh, seven uh, it's uh, it's a fast what they call a fast rgb so it's all the color uh, alternating fast there you go and then the next scene it's the same one but slow so it's slow rgb if you prefer the slow one so that was the scene eight and then we have uh, scene nine you have uh, sos here we go, not easy to focus when you have a blinking light in the background, but it's a SOS basically. It, uh, the light would flash in a Morse code to display a SOS signal. All right, and I don't think there is a send 10. Ah, yes, there is send 10. So 10 preset uh, mode or scene. Here we go, see it's candle light, so it simulates the light that make a candle. So there we go. And that's it for the scene, we are back to one. Now, double click again, and we go to this mode, OCT mode. It's actually a mode for just the uh, white lights or daylight. Uh, you can set the color temperature and of course the brightness, so I'd set at 20%. Here, it's the color temperature. I can use the knob to set 
my color temperature a bit down so now the light is going to turn a bit orange there we go <laughs> so i'm here and if i click once i go to the brightness 20 percent and i can increase the brightness here we go double click next mode again when you can select each brightness and hue and saturation basically and you can set each of those lines separately like the rgb i show you previously double click again and we are back to the rgb which i like with this light i don't know if you just noticed it came back to the setting i just did before it didn't reset everything it should be a big pain if you have to redo all the time everything if you just change scene so that's good let's see now if it keep in memory if i shut off the device press all the few seconds device is off and now press all the few seconds Device is on and yeah it keep my setting so <laughs> that's nice i had the other device all the time you shut off the power to the device the power just lost the setting and then you have to reset everything and it's very really annoying so that's nice that this wand will actually keep the setting that i like excellent all right off for now that's perfect here we go and remember those uh, weird uh, metallic uh, plates that has this uh, free hem sticker on the back i was wondering what they were for well i figured it out the light actually in the back happened to be magnetic yes on each corner here and here it's magnetic buzz so you can just stick it to any magnetic surface and it just will stay so that's awesome or if the surface you want to mount the light is not magnetic that's where those plates come to use because you can just stick them where you want the light to be stick and then here you go see to just the light will come and pop on each corner here and here and now you have your light mounted wherever you want using those plates but again any metallic surface your light will just stick as is without any trouble so that's uh, good i just find out about that so that was pretty um, interesting uh, function of the light to find out about that's my favorite uh, camera light now i'm sure and uh, that's how it works hope this video has been useful for you i'm very impatient to try it now and uh, film a few things with it but you have an idea what to get with this set the light and of course the fantastic here we go here it is <laughs> the fantastic soft velvet pouch to put everything inside with all the uh, included accessory anyway thanks for watching hope this video has been uh, useful uh, see you next time bye bye